Hello all my beautiful sisters from those other misters. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a Priceline Beauty Prescription Live haul. So if you are not familiar with the Beauty Prescription Live is, it's essentially an event that's held twice a year where uh, retailers that stock in Priceline um, show us what's going to be new, what's coming from their brands basically. Um, it's held up in Sydney, Kat and I and Simon. We all flew up very early on a Thursday morning. We met at the airport at 5.30. Our flight was like 6.40 or something like that. It was, it was delayed. Um, we got on the plane and then they told us that there was a problem and we had to get off the plane and then we had to wait for another plane. Uh, so we got there quite late. We were a little bit rushed um, and then getting home we were delayed again. It was, look, the flights were stressful but the event is always um, really good. So let's talk about the good stuff. Before I actually get started, I should mention everything that you're going to see in this video is um, like out now or it's coming out very soon. Some things aren't coming out until um, early May, but these are the things that are coming. Um, okay, so I'm gonna start with Thousand Hour. They gave us some lashes. These are the My Selfie lashes. So they're quite dramatic. For me, they are dramatic lashes. Um, and Ardell were actually promoting a range of human hair lashes that they are releasing. They didn't have any um, for like giving out as samples, but they did give me a little pair of wispies. These are the baby Demi wispies. So they're like some of the smallest wispies you can get and perfect for someone like me with small eyes. Um, so if you like a natural hair lash, but you don't want an animal hair, um, Ardell have a range coming out. The next lashes are pretty exciting. So these are from uh, Manicare. It's the Glam Pro by Manicare line. These are magnetic lashes. Now some of you will know how I feel about magnetic lashes. However, these also come with or you can purchase a magnetic eyeliner so or magnetizing eyeliner so these are releasing in april um, and essentially what you have is the eyeliner so this is a oh yeah okay fine tip can we get that to focus nice fine applicator it's a liquid um liner and the magnetic lashes will stick to the liner so you don't have to fuss with two sets of lashes trying to get them to stick this is really cool um i have seen some videos online of other brands um or like I don't know. I don't want to say other brands because um, they they look like pretty generic. Like someone's come up with the idea and then manufactured it, and you know they they're not they're not companies that I'm overly familiar with. So I'm not sure if they're really legit. Um, but the technology is really cool. I'm excited to try it from a brand that I know and trust. Um, they gave us two sets of lashes. We've got an intense set and a natural set. I'm really keen to try this. I think Kat and I are gonna put it to the test over on Beauty News, so there we go. Another lash related product that's not lashes, but it's promoting healthy lashes. This is a L'Oreal Lash Serum. They're saying it's clinically proven. Uh, it contains castor oil, vitamin B5, amino acids, hyaluronic acid, uh, metacasticide, and phylloxane. I'm not sure what that is, but there we go. I know this is currently out in Priceline. I saw it at the Chadston store. So this is supposed to help lash health and lash growth. So they're saying 
Uh, 40, 94% agreed lashes look fortified. I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not too sure how you can see that a lash looks fortified, but okay. Um, 97% saw less lash loss. That's difficult to say. Um, and 81% agreed that the fringe looks fuller. So the fringe of the lash, which is like the, the edge of the lash. Um, so yeah, I'm going to give that a go. It's interesting. We were handed out some fragrances. Um, so this is a new, I think it's new-ish. It's from um, Juicy Couture. It's the Oi, We, We, We. Um, okay, so it's out now nationwide. Um, you can get it in 100ml for $120 or 30ml for $70. Um, and apparently the 30ml is exclusive to Priceline. This smells really good. They gave us a mini. I'm trying to open it. Oh, without spilling it. It's great. There we go. So that's a mini bottle. They also gave us a little sample of the Bow Delicious. Bow Delicious. There we go. That smelled really good too. Um, and Zoella. Zoella Beauty is coming to Priceline. So this is the Botanic O Body Mist. This smells great. I, I was surprised by this. Um, this is right up my alley. It's kind of like, oh, it's like fresh green floral. I love it. Um, so yeah, Zoella Beauty is coming to Priceline. Zoella Beauty is like wrapping up at the end of 2020. And they were like, yes, it is. Um, but until then, you will be able to get Zoella Beauty in Priceline. Look, I personally feel like Zoella Beauty should have been in Priceline from the start. It was in Target. And I just don't, I don't know that that's really the right thing place for it. Um, I think Priceline would have been so much better, but anyway, there we go. Okay, I've got some sort of random bits, which are tools and a palette. Revlon. This is the Player palette. Um, it's the Colorstay Looks Lookbook palette. So this is in the shade 910 Player. Um, this is a sort of blue. There's a sort of burgundy brown down here, some neutral shades and a green. Um, I like it. I like the look of it. I did have a swatch of some of these um, at the like the trade show or the expo type thing and they looked intriguing. I thought if I'm going to pick one, they had a whole bunch of them, but I thought if I'm going to pick, pick one, I want to pick one that's a bit punchy and uh, blue and green is punchy. Something new from Real Techniques is this. This is the Miracle Complexion Sponge, but it has glitter. It's a glitter sponge. Now, I, I don't know how that's going to... How do I open this? Come on, let's get you open. So hopefully you guys can see there, it is a glitter sponge. I don't know if this is going to like leave glitter on the face. It's hard for me to tell because I actually, like I've got sparkly glitter on me from uh, an eyeshadow that I used today. So it's kind of hard to tell. Um, but if it doesn't leave glitter on the face, then it's a winner because I really like these Miracle Complexion sponges and they're pretty. Like that, the glitter makes it pretty. Um, but if it's leaving glitter on the face, we're definitely not going to be the best of friends, um, but I'm going to give it a go anyway, because I'm curious. Some more things from Revlon. Uh, they gave us a couple of tools. So let's start with this one. It is the All Over Shadow Brush, um, long lasting high performance synthetic bristle. So it's a vegan brush. Um, and this is just an eyeshadow brush, but I'm, I want to show you guys the shape of it. Oh. Oh, I actually really like this. So we've got a matte black handle. It's very, very light. And then up here we have, it's just like an eyeshadow packing brush, but it's sort of in the shape of a fan. It's very dense, like an eyeshadow packing brush, what you would expect. Um, some good movement there at the tip of the bristles. It's nice and soft. I'm keen to use this. 
I really like the design of this brush. It looks it looks fancy. This is the sort of thing I would expect to see from quite a luxe brush company in terms of its design. So that's cool. And they are also bringing out or they have potentially already brought out this. It's a cool and deep puff um, facial roller. So it's meant to be jade. So there it is. Um, jade roller you've got a large end and a small end and you essentially just use it to like roll your face so it gives a little bit of a massage but it's good for cooling and de-puffing oh that feels good oh yeah oh I do like it stop making me like things that I don't need I know a lot of people are into these like these tools um, so there you go. If you want an affordable one that you can find easily, Revlon has one at Priceline. Natio, we have a little pack here that they gave us. Um, so this is the Sunkissed Prep Set and Glow. It's a limited edition color collection from Natio and it's inspired by Summer's Kiss on soft smooth skin products inside are the makeup setting spray <laughs> it says a fine mist to set makeup and help it stay in place all day with rose and aloe vera to hydrate and soothe the skin um the lady at the booth that was managing the booth she she sprayed this on my face and she said it's like you can use it like over makeup under makeup just on bare skin like whatever you want so let's let's do this okay mine's got like a an aggressive spot uh have you ever sprayed one of these and it's like fine in some spots but then it's got like a, a stronger jet in other spots that's this one has that so mine feels like it, it goes on an angle on the face um but it smells nice. It does smell like rose. Uh, there's also the Bronze Glow Perfecting Primer. And this guy is a jojoba and shea lip balm. Ah, let's see if this has a color. So this is called Sheer Smoothie. Oh, okay. All right. There we go. I don't think it's going to have a color. Actually, it does. It's a very, very sheer pink. I don't think it has a scent. All right, my girls at Essence. Uh, we love the girls at Essence. They're, they're great. Um, they gave us the You Better Work collection. So this is the workout range. Some of you will know how I feel about like workout makeup. Um, not my fave but then again I don't go to the gym so you know I don't I don't work out at all now this collection is coming uh, May 15th and I believe it's coming a little bit later like May 15th in Priceline and then a little bit later maybe a month later to Target so they gave us the camouflage concealer palette so there's eight shades of concealer and uh camouflaging or you could say that those last three are camouflaging because there's a peach a green and a yellow for color correcting uh there is a you better work volume and curl mascara people love essence mascaras i love essence mascaras so i wouldn't be surprised if that's really good it's a gym proof and waterproof um volume and curl mascara so that's pretty good uh this is the primer gym proof primer apparently this is fantastic i actually want to see what sort of primer we're dealing with here oh stop it i think i'm gonna like this interesting color it's it's actually blue like a pale blue it doesn't really smell like anything oh wow actually oh okay it's an SPF 20. It does smell like sunscreen when you like blend it out. Feels kind of like a hydrating moisturizer. I'm gonna try that. And the last product from Essence is the Fixing Powder. So again, gym proof, sweat proof. Oh, oh, there we go. That's a little 
sponge. Um, so it's just a white, it's gonna be like a translucent setting powder, yeah. CoverGirl, they also, there we go, <laughs> they also have their uh, workout range. So it's the Outlast Active Collection. This is available from April 2019. So you should be able to find it um, very soon, if not now. Uh, they've got the Outlast Active Setting Mist. So this is a cooling setting mist with all day wear. Locks makeup in place all day. It retails for $15.95. <sighs> Smells like cucumber. There we go. Uh, they've also got the Get In Line Active Liquid Liner. This one retails for $12.95. It's supposed to be a budge proof formula. There is a Active Foundation, $17.95. I don't have that one, but they did give us the mascara in the range. This retails for $19.95. It's an instant volume, 24 hour wear and sweat proof mascara. It's a Lash Blast Active Mascara. Last of the makeup items are from Beauty Next. Um, so Beauty Next, they have like a, um, a display in Priceline and they feature products from like The Balm and Elf and Barry M, stuff like that. Um, now in our little box, this is what they've given us. They've got the uh, e.l.f. Blemish Control Face Primer. I have a creamy lip stain from The Balm. Oh, there we go. It's like a pinky shade, vibrant pink. All right, cool. Uh, I've got a couple of items from Barry M. There's the Illuminating Strobe Cream, the Tri-Blend Highlighter, and uh, Body Glitter, Holographic Body Glitter gorgeous and they did give us a palette from the balm as well it's the meat matte adore um they had and i look I, i'm not gonna lie i was so sad that we we didn't get one of the palettes that they had that they were sh like showing as the next release it was the the balm tea palettes and also the um oh, what were they called they look like the license, like they've got the tins and they look like little license plates. I can't remember what the range was called, but they had the face palette there. Oh my God, it was gorgeous. I want it so bad. Um, but we did get, we got Meet Matt Adore, which is fine. It's still a great palette. So that's the color story there. It is a pretty color story. I will hold on to that one. So the Beauty Next um, display is always a little bit interesting because they swap the products out that they're featuring quite regularly. So that's cool. I like it. It kind of keeps it fresh. Not a bad idea. Let's move into some body products. I don't have much, so this shouldn't take too long. Bondi Sands is releasing a range of products designed to help support and maximize your tan. Uh, so fake tan, obviously Bondi Sands does an amazing fake tan um, and they don't really have any other like body care products to support healthy skin and maintaining that tan. So they got to work and they released a bunch. So one of the products that they've released is the coconut and sea salt body scrub. They also had a hand wash and I think a body wash. This is an oil-free body scrub with a coconut scent. Now, they've I believe the whole line was oil-free and it was designed that way so that you can use the products um, before doing a fake tan. So you would use this before doing a, a fake tan to prep the skin, make sure you get all that like dry, dead skin cells off the skin. And the oil, like there's no oil in it, so it won't interfere with the application of the fake tan, which is fantastic. Um, this one contains, uh, it's salt quartz, which is interesting. Uh, coconut fruit, which probably means there's like coconut bits in there. Um, walnut shell powder and coconut shell powder. So there we go. I'm keen to try this. From Jergens, they have, oh, I'm so excited about this. I fucking love Jergens moisturizers. This is skin firming moisturizer. So it's oil infused skin firming moisturizer with collagen and elastin. 
for cellulite prone skin. And this is the Jewett. I think the brand is Jewett. It is the dry foot and heel roll on heel balm for dry cracked skin. Let's get it going. A roll on balm for cracked feet. Mm. Oh, it smells kind of citrusy. Oh, I like it. And it's not greasy. I'm going to like that. So it says visible effects in three days for dry, rough, cracked and irritated skin on heels, feet, knees, knuckles, elbows and anywhere. Oh my God, elbows and knees. Let's move on to hair stuff. And this is a category where I brought home the most things this, this year. It was a very uh, hair heavy event. A lot of brands are bringing out new hair stuff. Let's start with Batiste. These are dry shampoos and they're releasing four of them. But these are dry shampoos with an added purpose, basically. So we've got Defrizz. This is designed uh, to, okay, they're all designed to be a dry shampoo. We've got three with an invisible formula and the volume one doesn't mention that it has an invisible formula. but. They're all designed to work as a dry shampoo, but then give you an added benefit. So the defrizz one is for frizzy and flyaway hair. It's got smoothing coconut. Uh, then we have hydrate, which is for normal or dry hair with moisturizing avocado. We have damage control uh, for hair that's weak or damaged with strengthening keratin. And then we have dry shampoo and volume. So this is to give you show-stopping volume with plumping collagen. So these are retailing for $12.95 each. And like I said, there are four in the range. So if you want a dry shampoo that helps to do something else on the side, Definitely check out this Batiste range. I'm excited to try these. That's that's cool. That's kind of what I want a dry shampoo to do. Like, give me the dry shampoo benefits, but if you can help me elsewhere, please do. Kristen S, which is a brand that came to Priceline last year, um, are releasing a new shampoo and conditioner. It is the Extra Gentle Shampoo and Conditioner. So they had their, like, signature shampoo and conditioner and basically they said some people said it was a little bit um too heavy for their hair so they listened and they've created a new one it's called extra dental shampoo and conditioner um it's a nourishing and calming gently cleansing shampoo and gently restoring conditioner so they are coming soon they didn't they're going to be 19 dollars each um, they didn't have any samples, but they did hook us up with a dry shampoo. Dry shampoo coming out the wazoo. A brand called Main Club. So this is a new brand to me. I'm, I'm not familiar with them. Uh, they hooked us up with hair masks. So these are hair treatment sachets. Um, looks like there are six in the range. It does say on the back of them that they all condition, tame frizz, strengthen, add shine, and repair. All right, I've just taken a, a closer look at the ingredients. And while they do have some things in common, um, you can see that they have different ingredients that are aimed to do different things. So I like, I believe it, I believe it. Um, but they're cute. They're probably, blah, 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 blah. they are probably not single use. Like, I don't know. You could probably get like four uses out of them depending on how much hair you have. Um, I would probably aim to get about four uses. So there we go. They're 50 gram sachets, uh, new to me. So that's cool. I will try them out. This product here is the Dry Fix Microtherapy Treatment. So this is a leave-in treatment that is supposed to hydrate and repair damaged hair. So um, you shampoo, you rinse, you get out, you towel dry, you put this on, you leave it in. It says you don't need to condition afterwards. Um, and there is a shampoo in this range. It's a dry fix repair shampoo. So there you go. Look, I love a good leave-in product. If this is great, then 
I'm gonna love it. it it's a thing since I'm talking about like treatment products and leave-in things so let's continue because I've got a few more this one is from nature box it is the secret repair cream it's got 100% cold pressed avocado oil this is a rinse out or leave on so you can rinse off after 30 seconds or leave it in on towel dried hair uh, silicon free paraben free artificial colorants um, cold pressed oil and vegan palmer's has released a new line it's called natural fusions and it contains hair and body products and it's a pretty big line uh, they gave us the chia seed and argan oil hair mask so you can buy it in a sachet like this uh, to try it out or you can buy it in a big tub if you want extra um, and then they have like shampoo conditioner styling products treatment products stuff like that so there's that. I'm keen to try this because I do like Palmer's products and they also hooked us up with some hair ties. So that's helpful. From a brand called Daily Naturals, we have the Treatment Ends Sealer. So this has Moroccan Argan Oil and it's designed to repair, seal and protect stressed hair. This is a leave-in product, which is cool. I love a good leave-in product. And yeah, I have the screwed up, jacked up, hair ends it's a thing um so i'm keen to try that daily naturals has quite a large hairline it appears so they do shampoo and conditioners um and then like scalp care products and treatment products which is pretty cool so there we go if i like that one they'll definitely be on my radar to check out more John Frieda, this is the Go, Go, bleh, Go Blonder Lemon Miracle Mask. So this strengthens fragile hair fibers before and after lightening. Now, they said this is like their version of Olaplex, which is pretty cool. And it's supposed to smell like lemons. I'll be very interested to try this because... I use Olaplex and I love Olaplex. I think it's fantastic. Um, and I would definitely like to be able to see how this compares to Olaplex. So that's interesting. It was just a matter of time before like sort of mainstream brands started to get on the bandwagon of creating products like this, whether they will be just as good as Olaplex or not will remain to be seen does anyone else uh have like a plague of cockatoos that come every year at the same time and just wreak havoc because they're here and they're wreaking noisy havoc from a brand called sasha pure and i believe this is uh sort of their debut into priceline we have some sasha inchi oil products so they gave us shampoo and conditioner sachets to try out. Um, and apparently uh, these are like deep conditioning products um, and the shampoo is designed to strengthen, restore and protect. And apparently these are, I think she said it was 48% more effective at improving hair hydration compared to argan oil which is pretty exciting i love 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 argan oil my hair responds to it so well um so i'm i'm keen to try these okay let's talk about that micellar water shampoo that uh i mentioned earlier so pantene has created a micellar range so we've got the micellar gentle cleansing shampoo and the micellar gentle nourishing conce concealer oh my god conditioner this is a silicon free shampoo and conditioner range and they had one for i think they have one for dry hair normal hair oily hair this is the one for normal hair so i'm giving it a go um I was intrigued by this. I'm very intrigued. They say that this is gentle enough to use from like root to tip. And usually you wouldn't do that with shampoo and conditioner. Shampoo you use in the roots and you let the soap suds like rinse the ends um, when you're washing it out. And conditioner you use on the lengths, but you don't put up near your scalp because it makes it 
like weighs it down um, and they said basically you just you use this all over both of them all over so I don't know I think it's a very interesting I am 100% going to give these a go Ethique which is a they're, they're a brand that does like packaging free products um, I have used their body polish before it's fucking amazing they did give us a shampoo bar last year in October and this year they've given us a conditioner bar for normal to dry hair I'm gonna now that I've got them both I'm gonna I'm gonna use them this smells like their body polish so it's got this gorgeous lime scent oh my god it smells amazing so essentially what you're supposed to do is take this through your ends and just sort of pull it through and then you know massage it in and rinse it out so I'm gonna give that a go it smells amazing I like if my hair doesn't like it I'm gonna use it as like a body conditioner I just know I will because it smells so damn good um, from bedhead by Tiggy I have two products I have the queen for a day thickening spray so it's a superstar spray you are supposed to, so it says, spray onto roots, follow with the uh, Superstar Blow Dry Lotion, um, or spray all over for a glam slam. Now, it's supposed to like volumize and help thicken up the hair. And then they also gave us the OB Hive. Uh, this is a matte dry shampoo, so more dry shampoo. Um, but this thickening spray, I'm intrigued because my hair is flat as a tack. I could go and get it trimmed so it's got a bit more lift, but I don't want to. I want to grow it. Okay, we need to move into skincare. Uh, I do have a lot of skincare products. I'm going to start with this guy, I think. This is the only cleanser that I have. Um, this is a Neutrogena Deep Clean Cleansing Oil. So it is a refreshing cleansing oil that removes makeup and deeply cleans for soft, clear skin. I love cleansing oil. I'm totally down to try this. From Biore or Bior, Biore, uh, we have the Blue Agave, Agave, Blue Agave and Baking Soda whipped nourishing detox mask so it's supposed to be like hydrating on the skin but help with like blemishes and detoxifying the skin as well so that is it's an interesting one oh interesting all right i'm gonna have to give it a go have a play with it see what it's like um i believe they had another one in the range as well if i remember correctly I have a bunch of serum type products. I'm gonna start with this one from Trilogy. I love Trilogy skincare. They have a new vitamin C serum. So this is a vitamin C booster treatment. So this is one that you activate yourself so it's nice and fresh. And I believe it's meant to be a 30 day treatment. No, two week treatment. So you get this guy and you get a dropper and what you do is you load it up by pushing this top down and then you take the top off and you put in your dropper and you use it I'm not going to activate it now because when I start activating it or when I activate it I want to actually use it uh, it contains six percent vitamin C uh, hyaluronic acid and daisy there we go. I love vitamin C products. I can be a little bit, I don't know what it is with my skin. For some reason, it's a little bit sensitive to vitamin C. Um, but I want to give it a go. And if my skin's good with it, I want to use it for the two weeks. I want to enjoy it. They also have the vitamin C uh, moisturizing lotion. So this contains vitamin C rosehip and daisy. Uh, that's just a little like trial sample tube that they gave us it comes in a bigger tube though so I'm gonna try them out together from a brand called clear skincare we have the copper peptide serum I'm keen to try this because I know my skin responds well to uh, the copper serums this is so cool it almost looks like it glows from within I love it it's not catching on camera but it looks 
it looks sick. I'm really, I'm keen to try that product. Um, that brand is all about like, you know, skincare that's supposed to work, targeted problems, um, treating problematic skin. So there we go. From Ozmetic Co, uh, we have the Intensive Peptide Facelift Serum. So this is like step three. They have a whole range that is like numbered out. So, you know, like what does what at each step. Um, and this is, it says Intensive Peptide Facelift Serum provide instant deep hydration for 72 hours and help improve the appearance of fine lines and expression wrinkles. Give me that hydration. From The Ordinary, uh, they hooked us up with the Caffeine Solution 5%. So this is an eye product and it's supposed to target puffiness and discoloration around the eyes. So there it is there. This is gonna be my first ordinary product that I've tried. Uh, the next product that I have, and I think this is the last serum, this is the non-gender specific everything serum. So it's good for wrinkles, fatigue, elasticity, hyperpigmentation, pore size, brightness, and cellular, cellular rejuvenation. I don't know too much about the product or the brand. Um, I do see it's got tripeptides in there, which is really good. And the rest seems to be like plant extracts, oils, stuff like that. So... I'll give it a go. Um, it says the luxurious serum featuring 17 powerhouse ingredients that deliver astonishing results for visible brightness, reduced pores, size, smoother lines, wrinkles, firm skin, refined texture, radiant glowing complexion. Um, so there we go. We'll give it, look, I'll give anything a go that says it's gonna, oh gosh, it's a big bottle, 50 mil too, that's pretty good. Um, I'll give anything a go that says it's gonna make me look younger. Oh wow, look at the color. Look at that. Oh, it smells good too. Oh, it smells citrusy. And it just disappears into the skin, which is really nice. It's not oily or anything like that. There was a New Zealand brand there called Cotia, and they make skincare products. And they hooked us up with some samples of the New Zealand Deer Milk Brightening Eye Cream and the Hydrating Day Cream, which is also an SPF 15. So it looks like they have eight products in their range. Let me show you this. Ah, oh, help. There we go. So eight products. Um, we have a cleansing milk, a toner, there's a night cream, a cream mask, a day cream with the SPF 15, brightening eye cream, a rejuvenating serum, and then a revitalizing hand and nail cream. They use uh, deer milk as like one of their key ingredients. And I remember the guy there was saying that um, while people who were working with this particular like deer milk product, they had beautiful, smooth, youthful hands and they were like we need to bottle this so they did so they're saying it's a natural discovery um it's scientifically enhanced dermatolo dermatologically tested it's a new zealand sourced and made product and it's farmed with care which is really nice okay let's get these little masks out the way gunnier they have some hydra bomb eye masks so they've got the ultra hydrating firming eye mask with coconut water and hyaluronic acid. And then they have the ultra hydrating energizing eye mask with orange extract and hyaluronic acid. I'm gonna give them a go. I really like a good eye mask these days. Another item from Neutrogena. So I was looking at their uh, deep clean cleansing oil. That's one that they gave us. and. Um, I was talking to the girl, um, about like, you know, my skincare and I'm like, I love cleansing oils. I've been using them exclusively, uh, recently because, um, my skin was adjusting to a retinol and, you know, it gets dry and the skin comes off and I like to use, um, gentle things that are like, you know, 
they remove makeup really, really gently without upsetting the skin. Um, and also like they're hydrating, they don't strip the skin. And she's like, oh my God, if you, if you're into retinols, you also have to take this guy. So this is the rapid wrinkle repair. It's a regenerating cream. Uh, it says regenerates visibly younger looking skin in just one week. It has accelerated retinol SA highest concentration. So let me just show you retinol SA highest concentration. I'm not sure what retinol SA is on the back. It says accelerated retinol SA is a unique combination of the following ingredients. Retinol SA, it's an exclusive sustained action works to continuously renew the look of skin throughout the day helping to smooth wrinkles fast and diminish the look of dark spots retinol sa is scientifically superior to other forms of vitamin a such as pro retinol and retinyl palmitate in its ability to prove in its ability to prove benefit okay uh, it also has glucose complex it's a retinol SA booster that accelerates skin surface activity for rapid results on the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. And it has hyaluronic acid, which helps to hydrate and plump and all that stuff. It says it's gentle enough for daily use and it's supposed to be clinically proven to help fade the lines of coarse deep wrinkles, including crow's feet, forehead and cheek wrinkles regenerate the look of skin and smooth the look of fine lines. Now, look, I, I have been getting into retinol, like uh, trying to understand retinol, how it works, what types of retinols are like, you know, cause there's different levels of retinol and they take longer to work depending on what level they are. And I'm very, very slowly, learning about that and it's confusing and it's taking me a while to get there but i've learned a little bit so there's an ingredient in here that's called phenoxyethanol and from my understanding it's used as a preservative and usually it's used in very small amounts it's quite low on a, an inky list um and it's like it's up here right I don't know if I can get it to focus on this, but it's, it's sort of midway in the ingredient list. And then retinol is down here, like really far down. It's in the second last line. And look, the thing with retinol is like in low doses, it can work. Um, and I believe it, it's like, it does work. Like retinol works essentially. Like the science shows that it, it works and in low doses, it still works. Um, but it can be so low that it only really acts as like an antioxidant and it doesn't do the whole reversing the bad stuff, um, that's happening with the aging of the skin. Uh, if it's, too low so i do wonder if this is too low um and yeah i just i don't know i feel like this is one that um i need to i need to do more research on it to try and understand like what percentage of retinol it's meant to have in it because it doesn't actually say and i want to know because i don't i don't particularly want to go from um using what I'm currently using, which I know is good for me at the moment because I'm seeing improvements to something that is lower than what I'm currently using because I'm happy with what I'm using. And I don't, mm, hopefully you guys can understand where I'm coming from. I am definitely not in a position to be opening up another retinol product at the moment. So I'm gonna hold on to this until I have like a bit more of a better understanding about it. And I'm gonna do my research. I'm gonna see how I feel about it. Um, but yeah, the, look, retinol. I love retinol. It's a retinol product, but I, I also wanna make sure that um, I'm not going backwards when I'm trying to go forwards. I've got three more skincare products. Let's do L'Oreal. This is the Revita Lift Laser Renew Glycolic Pads. 
So these are anti-aging glycolic peeling pads. Uh, so it's meant to deal with wrinkles, texture, and tone. If you know what glycolic acid is, then you're gonna be like, oh, I know what this is about. I know what it's meant to do. Um, but essentially it's an acid. These are sealed. I'm not gonna open them because I actually have a similar product to this that I'm using at the moment. Um, but yeah, it's a glycolic acid. Or glycolic acid is supposed to like, you know, it's an, chemical exfoliant it's supposed to like clear out the pores and keep the skin nice and smooth um they're saying 6.9 percent glycolic complex so these have a textured side and a smooth side so if you uh need a softer exfoliation um and you just want to apply the acid without like using a textured side which might also manually exfoliate you can do that um i'm going i'm going to give both a go that just sounds fun avoid eye and lip area don't tell me what to do um <laughs> no avoid eye and lip area with acids um yeah i'll give these a go that's that's cool i i love glycolic acid my skin responds really well to it so it's a yes from me then I have a mask from Andalou Naturals. So they are releasing the Canacel Glow Mask. This is a hemp stem cell face mask. Um, and I did ask, I was like, oh, actually, okay. Some of you will know how I feel about hemp related things. I, I don't really buy into it, um, but the packaging is kind of cute. It's look it's grown up it's it's grown up stuff um so i asked basically they were like this is uh, an exfoliating mask um it's gonna help clear away the dead skin cells it's gonna like illuminate the face and hydrate and all that good stuff um and they're like put it on leave it on for like 10 to 20 minutes rinse it off and i was like can i leave it on overnight they were like no don't do that um, but there it is. It is a green mask. It's got a, a clear protective thing over it. I'm going to give it a go. Um, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. The last product that I have is from a brand called Cremor Lab. If you are a Korean skincare fr friend, <laughs> fan, you might be familiar with this brand. It is a Korean skincare brand and they are making their debut into Priceline stores, which is really exciting. So they had um, a good chunk of their range available for us to check out and we were allowed to like pick from different products. I chose a fresh water gel because I have actually used this product before um, and it's beautiful. This is a hydrating, look, I'm just gonna open it up because I'm probably going to dig into this very soon. So there is the tub. It does come with a little scoop um, on the top. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to show you guys. Can you sort of see? No, not really. Anyway, it has a really beautiful pattern on top. It's very subtle. It's like white printed onto cream. So it's kind of difficult to see. Oh my God, those bloody birds. And there it is there. So this is a gel cream and when you put it on it sort of it's like it dissolves into like a watery texture. It's so nice. I love this cream um, and when she was like you know choose which product you want I was like oh my god yes I get that watery cream again. Um, so yeah I'm really happy to have one of these in in my life and I'm going to use it and love it. Cremor Lab also make um, like an essence type toner product. Um, it's like a in a big bottle and it's like a clear liquid. That stuff is beautiful as well. That was a product that I really enjoyed from them. So um, I'm really excited to see more Korean brands coming to Australian shores and into the mainstream shops where things are easy to access uh, because they make beautiful skincare products. So I think it's fantastic. All right, let's do the last of the products, which I'm kind of calling health and well-being, but something that's none of that uh, is this from Mind Tan. This is a rose hydrating illuminating facial mist and it's a self tanner as well 
So this is a, a self-tanning, hydrating face mist. I'm going to give it a go. Oh. Uh-oh. This is going to be interesting. It's not going to be on my face long enough to know if it works. Um, but let, look, let's talk about it. So it's a self-tanning face mist and okay for starters the um the mister is a bit wet so if you've ever used a i don't i don't know really how to describe them i know how to describe the micro misters or the super fine misters and i think when you say micro mist or super fine mist people know exactly what you're talking about but this is just a standard mister, so it's a bit wet and it's not a super even spray. So I do suspect that if you sprayed this on your face like every day for maybe a week, you wouldn't have a completely even tan. Uh, it says to hold it at least 15 centimeters away from your face. Maybe that's where I went wrong. No, it's still... Can we show you? I don't know if you guys can see that. It's still kind of, even like the mister at the far end, it's still, yeah, I don't, I don't know. Look, it's interesting and I'm tempted to give it a go. I can always cover things up with makeup. I'm going to try it out because I am intrigued. Um, and if I do find that it's, you know, going on a bit patchy, I can put it into my micro mister and use it that way. Um, okay, let's do some teeth things. We've got some teeth stuff, um, which makes me excited. I brush my teeth a lot because I have Invisalign, so there we go. Uh, Oral-B, this is a 3D white whitening therapy enamel care toothpaste. So I use Oral-B 3D white products. We really like them in my, my house. Uh, my mum specifically, that's like her favorite. Um, but this is one with enamel care. So um, it removes up to 95% of stains in three days and it's a um, proven enamel safe formula. So I'm keen to try that. I actually saw this uh, in the supermarket a couple of days before I went to the Priceline event and I was like, oh, next time I need toothpaste, I'm gonna try that out. And now I have one, so that's great. From the Natural Family Co, we have the Whitening and Glow Natural Toothpaste. So this has Native River Mint in it, which sounds delicious. So it contains 25% xylitol, 70% organic ingredients. It's a gel formula uh, with a fresh mint taste, SLS, SLS paraben and sugar free non-GMO, no artificial colors or flavors, cruelty-free cruelty and vegan. There we go, natural toothpaste. Um, I also got a natural toothbrush or an eco-friendly toothbrush. So this is from a brand called Humble Brush and it is eco-friendly and socially responsible designed in Sweden. So these are 100% um, biodegradable, sustainably grown bamboo handles the bristles i believe were synthetic so the bristles are nylon from the base collective we have the magnesium and lavender beauty sleep spray so if you're not familiar with this brand they make uh, magnesium based products for pain relief so you spray them on i think they do a cream or a roll on I don't know, but they do magnesium products. The original magnesium spray, I don't even know how many I've purchased at this point. It's a lot. My mom was giving them to people at Christmas. Um, she's gone through about three or four bottles herself. She swears by it. She absolutely loves it. Personally, I've not used it um, because I don't really get a lot of muscle or like achy pains I get migraines and I'm not about to spray this on my face uh, so you know that's that's my thing um, but this one is designed to help you sleep sounder at night when you are dealing with 
pain. So you spray it on, um, the magnesium helps to treat the pain and discomfort and the lavender helps you sleep soundly. I am also going to pass this one on to Mumsy. Um, another like sleeping thing, uh, this is from Feather and Down. This is the Sweet Dream sleeping bag. So this brand has come to Priceline um, and they have launched with like a bunch of uh, sleeping, like help sleep aid products basically. Um, and they have a few different packs like this. So inside this one, there is the Sweet Dreams all purpose sleeping balm. Let's smell this. I think I'm actually going to be able to use these. Um, if you didn't know, lavender often gives me migraines, so I have to be pretty careful with them. Um, there are a lot of sleep aid products on the market that I cannot use because they make me go to sleep, but then I wake up in the morning with a raging migraine. So it's a problem. Uh, there is a little eye mask in there to help you sleep. You also get the melting shower cream. The pillow spray, I won't spray it on my pillows, I spray it sort of away from my pillows, but I'm going to give it a go because it doesn't smell like straight up lavender. Um, and then there is the all purpose sleeping balm, um, which you use to put on like pressure points. So there we go. That's a cute little pack. That's a nice little like gift item and that pouch is cute and reusable. From Medlab, they gave us a supplement product. So this is the Probiotic Immune Support. So this product helps to basically support, support, support and boost your immune system. Um, it is vegan, gluten-free, vanilla flavor, um, no sugar, but it does have stevia in it, which is a natural sweetener. There we go. All right, battery change, back into it. This is from a brand called JS Health. It's the Hair and Energy Vitamins. So they had four of these, and I believe they were, um, let me tell you what four they are. So detox and deep bloat, skin and digestion, hair and energy, which are these ones, and sugar and metabolism. I believe they were promoting the sugar balance and metabolism tablets which are supposed to um like help with sugar cravings and stuff like that to like lower your sugar cravings um i don't really get sugar cravings it's not something that i really struggle with i just get like like if i'm sort of going down in a heap like you know 330 itis i think many of us have heard of that um where you start to sort of lose your energy mid-afternoon um and you start reaching for like easy snacks i don't really get that um which is good occasionally i do but it's not like a massive problem and if i do get that i don't i don't reach for like sugar or chocolate or anything like that i'm more inclined to like make a sandwich or something um so she was like the lady who was talking about the vitamins she was like all right that's not for you um you know we've got other types um and this one spoke to me because um okay well it's a, a hair like healthy hair skin and nail vitamin which many of you will know i love um, but this also helps with increased energy throughout the day and it supports a healthy metabolic function, um, which is probably where I actually struggle. My, my energy levels are just like low always. It's not like a sort of mid afternoon thing. Um, so I'm keen to try them. I take vitamins anyway. Um, so it's exciting for me to be able to try a new brand. Um, but yeah these are available at priceline it's australian owned and it's they're designed by jessica seppel she's a best-selling health author and founder of js health so there we go the last product that i have is this guy it's called beauty bites so these are a combined illuminating and age-defying ingredients in a convenient 
single daily dose designed to help women to look and feel more beautiful from inside out. So they contain collagen, probiotics, prebiotics, vitamin C and vitamin E and they come in three different flavors. So these are snacks. <laughs> um, not really. They're, it's like a, yeah, it's a, it's a health snack basically. All right. So I've got two in here. There are three flavors. I've got apple, cinnamon, and white chalk raspberry and there is also lemon and coconut oh my god lemon and coconut sounds amazing let's go the apple and cinnamon these are like a really really dense muesli bar covered in the um the white chocolate white chocolate's not too sweet which is great um and apple and cinnamon tastes like apple and cinnamon it also has coconut in there i'm pretty sure I can see like bits that look like coconut. It's like a daily vitamin in a mini muesli bar basically, which is, it's interesting. All right guys, so that's it for me today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Massive, massive thank you to Priceline for inviting us along to the Beauty Prescription Live event. It's always a good time. Uh, hopefully one day we'll actually get there on time and not be delayed. Um, let me know if there is anything you saw in this video that you have either tried or if there's something that you've got your eye on you're going to keep an eye out for in or on line price line in store price line online pr let me know you know what i'm trying to say i'm getting tired it's been a very long day um i'm gonna i'm gonna head off thanks so much for watching guys i'll see you in the next one bye